Have you heard this song before? Yeah, the one that's been stuck in our heads since 1996. Well, things are starting to get spicy with this song. Watson Music Group, the big dogs claiming ownership on this banger, are starting to flex their legal muscles because they're sending out infringement notices like it's going out of style. Billboard spilled the tea just a few weeks ago. Watson's latest target is the Wisconsin Timber Rattlers. Yeah, a minor baseball team, not basketball. Apparently, they used the track in a 2017 Facebook video. As we know, if you put music behind any type of visual media, it's technically a sync placement and someone needs to be paid for. Now, why is this the fuss in making news? It's because Watson's price tag for using that legacy track is a cool $150,000. And this isn't the first time they've been charging this. They've been on a lawsuit spree for about three months now. Essentially, what is believed to happen is Watson has been sending out letters saying that these folks did not have a retroactive license. In layman's terms, this means if you borrow your neighbor's lawnmower without asking, then try to say you had a understood agreement when you finally get caught doing it. Look, I get it. Sync licensing can be very confusing, but imagine Imagine trying to use the track just to bring nostalgia to the field and getting a six-figure bill. Thankfully, their attorney is talking about hopefully settling with these infringers before things get too dramatic. And this just goes to show how expensive your music can actually become over time. File to get synced. Go watch more of my content.